wiki.easyvid.com. Search EasyVid Wiki before you decide. EasyVid presents the 10 best plastic welders. Let's get started with the list. Starting off our list at number 10, the June Jip 110 volt is suitable for mending ATV fuel tanks, car bumpers and kayaks. It boasts 80 watts of power that can heat the iron up to 525 degrees Fahrenheit. It comes with a heavy duty wire brush and a stand to hold the iron. However, the soldering tip deforms after a while. At number nine, it's easy to transport the go-to home professional anywhere, making it a smart choice for those who have to go out on service calls. It's quiet and suffers from minimal vibrations. There's a temperature scale printed on the gun and it includes a spare heating core, but the fan is fairly weak. Coming in at number eight in our list, the no brand Zero THS 001 is a 40 watt hot stapler that comes with four staple types for welding large surfaces, inside and outside corners and stitch tears. It shuts off automatically if the internal temperature exceeds 149 degrees Fahrenheit. It includes 200 staples and an LED indicator light, along with a one and a half meter power cable. Our newest choices can only be seen at wiki.easyvid.com. Go there now and search for plastic welders or simply click beneath this video. At number seven, the Chicago Electric Welding Systems 96712 is capable of generating temperatures as high as 850 degrees Fahrenheit, enabling it to repair even the thickest plastic. Despite the sizable punch it packs, it's still compact enough to work in tight spaces. It comes with both bent and curved nozzles and a built-in air motor, but it's not especially durable. Moving up our list to number six. The Bondic Pro Kit comes with an ultraviolet light that encourages molten plastic to solidify, at which point it can be polished and painted. It's perfect for small jobs and detail work. It dries very quickly and works on a variety of materials. However, the pen tends to leak. Halfway up our list at number five, the Master Appliance Pro Heat Kit is a highly versatile choice that includes a wide variety of attachments designed for different applications. It's capable of producing a constant temperature of up to 1000 degrees Fahrenheit, which is more than enough to handle most synthetic materials. It's equipped with a digital display and an adjustable airflow, but it is pricier than other options. At number four, this option from Chicago Electric has a 13-foot PVC air hose and a 19-foot power cord, making it a good choice for hard-to-reach jobs. Anyone who repairs signs, ductwork, or other overhead materials should give this model serious consideration. It breaks down paint and solvents well and features a thermal protector that prevents overload and a stainless steel barrel. Nearing the top of our list at number three, the Geno Development Iron comes with a set of plastic rods and wire mesh, along with a thorough instruction manual that's very handy if you're new to this sort of work. It also includes a hot iron stand and heats up quickly. It provides a maximum temperature of 525 degrees Fahrenheit. Our newest choices can only be seen at wiki.easyvid.com. Go there now and search for plastic welders or simply click beneath this video. At number two, the Hobie KC Pro is equipped with a durable steel body and a heavy duty tip, making this an option that should last for years to come. It's also not prone to overheating, so it's ideal for continuous use. It's an excellent choice for fixing kayaks. And taking the top spot on our list, the Polyvans 5700HT Mini lets you quickly fuse thick substances or those that have high melting points. It's equipped with a control dial for adjusting the temperature to suit the material at hand, giving it impressive versatility. It includes a helpful instructional video, a belt clip and two different tips. Our newest choices can only be seen at wiki.easyvid.com. Go there now and search for plastic welders or simply click beneath this video.